Yes. Hmm. Room under renovations. It's you! Alrighty. Ooh, what's, what's over here? These books are worn. They must have been read many times. Inside is an old calendar from the beginning of 21... 20x team. Hmm. Oh! Wait, an old? Wait, so if that's an old calendar, then... Oh, okay, okay, yeah, I remember now. So, then the kid who fell to the beginning is probably the one that I named. And then I'm the, uh... I forget. You see, this is what happens when you don't go into a blind. You notice things too early, and then, like, when it's revealed later, you're like, Oh yeah, I pretty much knew. <laughs> uh... I wish I had gone into a blind. It's a wonderful game. But I, I do know some things that happen later on, and a couple of spoilers, and... That sucks. <laughs> the ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far into the earth we walked until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, which we named... Home. As great as our king is, he is pretty lousy at names. Aw, that's funny. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You could put your hand inside. Please don't. Oh. For some reason, there's a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for giant gingerbread monsters. The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. The stovetop is very clean. Oriole must use fire instead of ma fire magic instead. Up already, I see. I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? What? This is your home now. Would you like to hear about this book I'm reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? How to exit the ruins. Um, how about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails sometimes flip their digestive systems as they mature? Interesting. How to exit the ruins. I have to do something. Stay here. No, 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 no. You aren't getting away with this. I'm gonna save. Determination. She's so determined. Go get her. Or him. I don't actually know. Nor do I care. Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. One may exit for No one will ever be able to leave again. Good child to go upstairs. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. Blah, 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 blah. Yep. This is pretty much the exact same as the, uh, the, the demo. Which was released, like, forever ago. This reminds me, I recently saw a really good voice-acted version of this.
fairing you. No! I killed you twice! I don't want to kill you again! The demo was painful enough. No! I don't want to fight you, Toriel. I killed you twice in the demo. I won't kill you again. I can't take that. Toriel, please. Get me. I'm sorry, Toriel. I know this is gonna break your heart. Sorry. I love you too, Goat Mom. Farewell, Goat Mom. Hey, this is, uh, the... the path that you see in the, uh... the trailer for the... for the game. And it has, like, images flashing by on the sides. Except Flowey isn't here. Uh, clever. Very clever. D did we ever do a voice for Flowey? I don't think we did. I don't think we were doing voices yet. Clever. Very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. <laughs> I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die and you'll die and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan is a regicide. This is so much more interesting. <laughs> I'm, I try to do a different voice for every face that he has. Thundersnail. By Toby Fox. Literally, he made like 90% of this. There's a camera hidden in the bushes? What? This is a weird soundtrack. Whoa! What the heck? It's a tough looking branch. It's too heavy to pick up. It's been smashed like it was nothing. 
Human, don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. The demo didn't go this far. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny! Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the Skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know... I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now my brother, the virus, he is a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thing. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. It is literally our exact shape and size. Sup, bro? You know what's up, brother? It's been eight days, and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles! You just hang around outside your station! What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp, it's really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that! What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready! I will be the one! I must be the one! I will capture a human! Then, I... The Great Papyrus! I'll give all the things I have to need, sir. Respect? Recognition? I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard! People will ask to be my... friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping, you lazy bones! All you do is sit and boondoggle! You get lazier and lazier every day! Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work to do today. A skeleton. Hey! Sans! Come on, you're smiling. I am and I hate it! Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone! Hey! Ah! I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. Yeah! <laughs> Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Just a conveniently shaped lamp. It's some sort of checkpoint or sentry station, but there are bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. So it's a hot dog stand. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. Uh, but you went behind. Whatever, doesn't matter. The convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination.